Hey there, how's it going on everybody? In this video, I'm gonna introduce CD5 facilities and what you can do with utilizing this panel. Make sure to check out our YouTube channel and if you want to get a HDVI panel, there are plenty of videos here that can help you out. Also, check out GitHub as well and if you scroll down all the way here and click on tutorials on wiki page, you can find all tutorials and videos section. If you encountered any problems with your panel, you can find your desired solution right here. So what is Edify? Edify is a third-party program in order to help you configure and set up mainly B2A proxies. It also supports Telegram proxy with several libraries. Well, first thing that you see after setting up your panel is the dashboard and I'm just gonna activate dark mode for saving my eyes. So, dashboard displays you an overall status of your user's usage and your server's resources live. The best thing about the dashboard is it uses pretty little memory and you can monitor overall stuff in one look. Let's head over to the ne next section, the users section. In this section, you can fully moderate the users, you can add new users, delete the old ones and even modify the existing ones. You can modify your user's name, limit the bandwidth and the expire time to your desire. Even leave a note for your future tasks to the user. You can also change when the user's account resets itself on a daily based cycle. Let's hit save. If you have a numerous amount of users, you can search them specifically in order to maintain them. Also, you can select multiple users and delete them all at the same time. If you've already set up a Telegram bot, you can message to a specific user by clicking the little icon next to them. You can also make global announcement to all of your users using this section here. You can give your users their own panel link under the users link column. And if you click on them, as you can see, it redirects you to a panel that shows you the traffic usage of the user, expire time, and in this section, you can uh, choose all of the configs that you desire. You can also use subscription link to automate all the copyings out. Now let's check upon the admin section. Here, as you can see at first, you are the super admin. That means you have unlimited access to the panel, but we don't want every moderator to have the full access to the panel. This is where this part shines. You can start by hitting the create button. Write in your desired name and select a level of privilege. Well, super admin is a super admin and it will have full access. Admin can moderate users and have a limited access to some of the settings. Agent on the other hand can only manage users and the super admin can limit all of the accesses as well. Hit save and give the link to whom you trust. You can give the desired link by copying this one here. EDFI fully backs itself up every 6 hours and if you have telegram bot set up, it sends the backed up files via the telegram bot and it also saves all of the backed up files inside a specific folder on your server. You can restore the panel pretty easily by just doing a few clicks. Panel uses the latest version of X-ray core which also contains reality support as well. In the latest update, We've added sync box core as well, which also is a good alternate core to X-Ray. Every 3 a.m. in the morning, panel checks itself up for an update, and if there is one, it would automatically update itself. This feature can be turned on and off. In settings, domain section, you can use multiple domains and subdomains here. You can also separate the proxies domains and sub subscription domains in order to prevent your server from getting restricted. Be aware of the fact that subscription links will generate automatically and you don't need to modify anything manually. You also can add and specify your 
relay servers pretty easily whether you are using ip tables ghost ssh channeling etc etc on your relay server Hidify can also randomize your subdomains in order to separate the traffics amongst them for preventing domain restrictions and right now we are inside settings as you can see there are quite a lot of sections here let's just go through some under the customizing user page you can customize your user's web page just modify these fields by changing the title or add a support link for your users and let them know how to reach you you can do initial server settings such as changing the dns server disabling the ip version 6 under general settings section you can decoy a website as well Decoyed website uh, will fake a website on root of your domain for detecting preventations. In here, you can block and unblock some domestic websites and even uh, activate or disable some of the older and weaker protocols. You could use domain fronting to simulate other websites as your SNI, which is pretty useful. But since Cloudflare doesn't support it anymore, you have to consider using another CDM provider. Under the Telegram Proxy tab, you can activate your own Telegram bot by pasting your token here. Some of the things that you can do with the Telegram bot were mentioned before, but you can also manage and update your users via the bot as well, but the options are limited compared to the panel itself your users can use the telegram bot to view their usage and remaining time you can create a telegram proxy with the library of your choice here if your server got flagged by the google's vpn restriction system and some sanctions applied to your ip address you can use the warp plus to bypass them setting it up is pretty straightforward you just need to paste your key in the warp plus key field Choose how you are going to use the service, submit and apply your configs. If you want to automate things more, you can pass paste in your Cloudflare API so Edify can automatically create and manage your subdomains here. Edify supports all of the X-ray protocols and you can select which ones do you want to use in the proxy section. You can also create customized proxies as well if you are not happy with the default ones. Beside the Hidify panel and administration facilities, Hidify also provides its own clients, which have a smart proxy and it can handle the best proxy for you, for you based on your internet connection. They also support load balancing and fragment feature, which we will explain them in their own videos. Be sure to check Hidify N for desktop and Hidify NG for Android. And that would be it for this video. Be sure to leave us a like. If you have any question, comment down below and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching.